So you have a Amazon Fire Max 11 tablet and you have an issue with a black screen. Even though you have a black screen, you know that it's on, okay? So just really quickly, this one here is actually working, but even if I had a black screen here and you wanna know if it's on or not, if you go ahead and plug it in, give it a charge, you're gonna hear that chime, okay? So I'm gonna give you several solutions to get your screen back up and running. All these uh, steps you can do at your home, nothing to do with taking this apart or anything, okay? And if you guys, if you guys do every single step, I'm gonna say at least 70% of you guys will have a working screen, okay? So first thing is, uh, let's just pretend I have a black screen here, okay? So I have a power button here. So first thing we wanna do is press and hold that power button for about 16 seconds and then let go and it's gonna turn off turn off completely and then we're going to press and hold to boot back up we're basically forcing a restart okay so pretend my screen here is black okay pretend it's black here's the power button go ahead and press it and hold it for 16 seconds ready set go press and hold don't worry about what's happening on my screen here let's pretend my screen is black here i'm still holding on for that power button hold it on for about 16 seconds okay you want to wait uh until it's actually fully powered off okay 14 15 16 now let go and just wait a few seconds and now I'm going to turn it back on press and hold that power button now I'm just going to keep on holding just wait till you see the Amazon logo and hopefully you see that and if you do just wait until it boots back up and hopefully you have a working screen now if not we're going to go to the next possible step okay so your screen is still black no problem now also I forgot to uh, mention but if you guys have a case on here or like a keyboard attached take everything off okay so the next step here is first thing we're going to do this so you see the power button here what I want you to do is spam the power button okay do it like 10 times in and out kind of hard like that now because it's possible that your uh, power button could be jammed stuck you can have debris in there uh, you can have lint in there uh, you can have like lotion or coffee stuck in there and it can cause a black screen as well so we just spam the power button now we're going to go ahead and plug it in just like that and now while it is plugged in and it is charging pretend my screen here is black again we're going to go ahead and press and hold that power button ready ready set go press and hold while it's charging count the 16 seconds okay don't worry about what's happening to my screen here we're going to hold it for 16 seconds still holding 14 15 16 seconds now let go and wait a few seconds and now we're going to go ahead and press and hold again the power button and just wait for the Amazon logo to appear okay it didn't do it because I probably did it too fast oh anyway okay so it's booting back up now there's the Amazon logo and you can go ahead and unplug from here and hopefully it boots up in your screen it is now working if not we're going to go to the next possible step okay so you still have a black screen no pro no problem the next thing we're going to do here is what I call the tap method so what we're going to do is just lay our uh, tablet on the desk right here and we're going to grab two fingers like this and what we're going to do is tap kind of hard all over on the screen and all over on the back side as well and it's the same and the reason why we're doing this because it's possible that you have a cable ribbon that's slightly disconnected or dislodged and a little tap believe it or not can pop it into place okay so from here just go ahead and just keep tapping kind of hard like this all over and then once in a while as you're doing that you may want to go ahead and just um, tap on that power button every once in a while as we're doing this. Just keep on doing all over and then tap on that power button to see if your screen is on. Okay, if not, no problem. Turn it over and we're going to do the same thing on the back side here. Okay, you got to do it kind of hard, all right? All over. Especially around the lens. You don't want to smudge up the lens. You can go ahead and put a cloth on there. Now, go ahead and flip it over and tap on that power button and see if your screen is off. If it's still off, no problem. From here, again, press and hold that power button for 16 seconds. So just wait here. Pretend my screen is totally black here again. Still holding on to the power button. 13, 14, 15, 16 seconds, go ahead and let go. 
wait three to five seconds and now I'm gonna go ahead and press and hold that power button again and just wait till you see Amazon logo and then let go and hopefully you are out of the black screen once it boots up if not no biggie we'll go to the next possible step okay so after that last method your screen is still black so the next thing we're gonna do now is what I call the massage method okay what we're gonna do is basically hold the tablet like this over here and what we want to do is massage basically press all over the screen and all over the back it's the same premise with the tapping you might have a ribbon that's slightly disconnected okay if you don't want to smudge up your uh, your screen or whatnot you can put a cloth on there but we'll start off on the screen here and we're gonna go ahead and press press kind of hard guys press press not too hard where you're gonna crack it okay press press all all around the corners everything press press if you guys hear a little click anywhere then go ahead and tap that power button and see if your screen is on okay if not no problem just continue the massage all over keep pressing okay and the same thing on the back here go ahead and grab your thumb just press 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 keep on going keep on going around the lens too especially and also, even if you're on the back and if you hear a little click, then just turn it over and tap that power button, okay? Anyway, after you massage the back, then just go ahead and tap the power button and see if your screen is on, all right? If not, no problem. Then from here, same thing. Press and hold that power button for 16 seconds. After 16 seconds, when it's fully turned off, let go and then wait a few seconds and then press and hold again. Wait till you see the Amazon logo, then let go, and then hopefully now you are up and running with a working screen. If not, we're going to go to the next possible option. So the next possible option here is what I call the smack method. Uh, similar to the uh, the same premise with the, uh, the tapping of the massage, you may have a ribbon that's slightly dislodged, okay? So what we're going to do is we'll start off on the screen here. So we're going to hold it like this, and you're going to smack the screen, okay? Also on the bottom of the screen as well, okay? Now from here, go ahead and tap that power button. See if your screen is on, okay? If your screen is half on or you see like white lines, then we have to keep on going, okay? So now we'll go ahead and smack the back, okay? Pretend my screen here is totally black. And we're gonna go ahead and smack the back all over. Also on the bottom of the back. Now go ahead and Tap on that power button and see if your screen turns on, okay? If not, it's still black, no problem. From here, again, press and hold that power button. Wait 16 seconds, or basically when you think it's all turned off, let go, give it a few more seconds, and then press and hold to boot it back up. And when you see the Amazon logo, let go, okay? And hopefully your screen is working. If not, next possible solution. So the last method I have uh, for you, uh, besides doing like a, trying to do a factory reset, is put this in the freezer okay so grab your tablet like this where it's nice bare and naked go to your freezer put it in your freezer where it's nice and cold leave it there for 15 or 15 to 20 minutes after 15 to 20 minutes take your nice cold tablet out of the freezer and then tap that power button and see if your screen is on if it's still off no problem while it's nice and cold Press and hold that power button for 16 seconds. After about 16 seconds, let go, wait a few seconds, and then press and hold to turn it back on. Now, the thing is, if you guys tried all the steps the first time and it didn't work, try it a second time. Try it a third time. There's times I tried like seven, it tried at least seven times, okay? I mean, there was times uh, in the past where maybe I tried it like 11 times and it finally like booted up uh, and on different, um, different kind of tablet. Anyway, if you guys did it at least seven times, I'm going to say maybe at least 70% of you guys should now have a working screen, all right? So this worked for you. Comment below. Please comment which step or which combination of steps work for you or you think that it worked for you. Okay? Good luck, guys.